Hi, you guys. This is Gina here. I had uh, was doing a doing a pour, and I stopped because I want you to see the process of this. Now, I had I ordered some from Amazon. It's called um, diffraction. paper diffraction paper what it is it's holographic paper and i haven't received it in yet so what i had was some glitter flakes and i bought these i don't know how long ago probably two three years ago at the dollar tree and these are the it's called crystal iris so yeah what I did was mix of my resin six ounces of hardeners it's six ounces of gloss which gave me uh, just a thin thin line I only I didn't want to fill this whole whole mold up because I am doing a, uh, I'm putting it in a frame, a photo in there, and with some lights. So this is going to take a series of, uh, what do you want to call it, a series of um, a video. So I'm filming this. as I go each day because this is going to take a couple of days for me to do a few days so what I'm doing when you get your fraction paper and I'm going to show you a video of what fraction paper is it's basically holographic film paper like this you don't want to touch it because if you touch it then you're going to lose the holographic so that's why I'm just kind of being careful of what I'm I'm getting um, I'm just adding just a little bit on the out, outer part I don't want a lot and I don't want a lot because the photo is going to go in the middle and I think the photo is just going to cover straight up up there so that's why I'm just doing it on the sides of this mold and I'm gonna see how what if it if it'll work if it'll do what I want it to do okay <laughs> my my deal is if I put this fraction flakes I'm trying to get some. See this? This isn't even fraction because it was touched. So when you get it, you want it to look fraction. You know, I guess that's why they call it fraction paper. And yeah. 
as you can see I have a thin thin coat a really thin coat and I'm just gonna let that sit until when it gets tacky and um, we'll come back yeah because I'm thinking the photo that I'm using it's a photo of my mom of old black and white women I guess she was young young but I did it with I went ahead and made a copy of it just on regular paper of her photo and I sized it down then I laminated it and then I just trimmed all the way around the laminator and it'll go in like this so I don't want too much because I could put some more there because I still got to put the lights in and you know And what I'm going to do is just wait till this gets kind of tacky. So the first lay was only six ounces. Six and six. I haven't even done the base yet because I'm not worried about the base right now because I the base won't have a light it will connect right here that's what I'm thinking my light and because this is the base and it turns let me show you oh I have it way up there I can't show you <laughs> if I move things so I'm going to let this dry just for a little bit till it gets tacky and I'll be right back okay okay I'm back now what we're going to do is what I done with the tiny lights I just curled them on this pencil because I'm gonna go around the heart does that make sense actually I wanted to go like this okay and let me show you these are the Tim Holtz tiny lights the ideology you get two in a packet. Uh, I don't even remember how much they cost. Anywho, let me see what we got since this morning. I went ahead and put mom's picture in. And we'll go ahead and remove this. And there goes my honey singing. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and add these lights. And let's string them out a little bit more than what. It's still tacky in there. But that's okay. Yeah. Just a little bit more.
And you know what? I wasn't thinking. I should have added something on the back. You know? There. I wasn't thinking, y'all. Okay, now that we got our tiny light in, I'm just going to push it aside because I do got to do a mix. And that's going to take a while. But I wanted the lights in. Okay. There. And that's going to be really cute, y'all. Hopefully. <laughs> I had a uh, friend ask me if I could do this. And I said, yeah. So I thought about doing this video so she can see. How I do it. Actually, it was my boss. And Gerald says, hey. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and um, I'm thinking about adding these. And what these are like little crushed glass. I got these on Amazon too. You get this whole packet. of 24 I say they're about an ounce they're three ounces some range different so yeah I'll go ahead and zero out this and I'm gonna go ahead and add some in there just to give it an effect you know so I'm going to go ahead and shut the video off till I mix this. Yeah, 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 y'all don't. I mean, really. Because it's a long mixture. Okay, y'all. I forgot. I needed to add some flowers to that. And I got these from Amazon, too. These are the fall. Um... I don't know if these are going to work in here. These are just my journaling stickers that I get on Amazon. I, you can get them on, uh, what's that other website? I don't like to go to it because I don't like to wait. That AliExpress. I think I'm going to be better off with these smaller ones. Yeah, instead of these, because these are too big to fit in the area. Let me put these back. I think I'm going to go with these. I 
and I'll try to put the description in the box below of all the stuff that I'm using in this video. Not much. I've never used these before, y'all. I wonder what's it going to look like Y'all see what I did? Dang. I'll put that backwards, y'all. Hmm. 
Okay. I hope that didn't ruin it too bad. <laughs> Sit there and watch me pick it. <laughs> I don't want this to curl up when I add the These I tore it. That's okay. Hmm. Sorry if my head's in the way all. Okay, I got my resin ready. Let's see. I might have to do another. Had excruciating toothache all night, y'all. Digging on my last nerve. So what do I do? I could dope myself up last night. <laughs> Finally dozing off. I said, oh my God, it's hardly time for me to wake up. I'm calling in. <laughs> then I woke up later. Called my dentist. 
We're sorry, but our office is closed due to the holiday. What holiday? I look on my calendar. Juneteenth. Oh my God. And it wouldn't matter anyways because the banks are closed too, so. I'm going to have to do another batch of resin to get this full of how I want it. So, And this is just alcohol, 100%. Then I spray in there to get rid of the bubbles and whatnot. And I hope that this sets really good overnight. Because it's hot, and I don't like to pour when it's hot. And what I do with my spoon. And I have to keep this room really cold. A bit too much there. They're movable. <coughs> and these tools that I'm using, I use these on my other molds to paint. Like if it's a mold that needs to be painted, like stitch, Lilo and Stitch molds that I have. And these are my dotting tools. Therefore, that reason. Oops. Oh. <laughs> That's kind of scary. And what I should have done, y'all, is put... What is that? You see that? I don't know what it is. But it's not staying in there. Okay, that's it. I'm trying to see if the holographic is taking any effect on the resin. You know what I'm saying?
Yeah, and I should have put like a backing on this picture. And I'd like to, this is what I'm trying to say, I'd like to get me a better, um, it's hard to, let me do another, um, Always cover your projects because you don't want nothing flying in there. After all that hard work we just now did. <laughs> <coughs> I'm going to go ahead and uh, shut the camera off because I'm going to do another three ounces, I guess. I'm going to put these up because I'm done with these. Yeah, I'll put everything in the description box below on all my st stickers that I use. And, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and turn this off so I can go ahead and make, do another mix. And I'll be right back. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and add some flower, uh, butterflies and these flowers that I found. We got a little boo-boo going on. See that? We got a little boo-boo going on. <laughs> oh no. So we're gonna hide our boo-boos. And I thought, oh no. <laughs> Put these on the back, these beautiful flowers. So we don't see the boo-boo. They don't see the boo-boo. And I don't see the boo-boo. we got boo-boos going on yeah kind of hard to see are these not so are these not stickers these ain't stickers y'all The other ones are.
Mm. You know, these ain't stickers. These are not stickers, y'all. It's all right. Where's my scissors? <laughs> See what I'm trying to do, y'all? And these are just the Dollar Tree stickers. Anytime you're using the resin, don't use the foil part. Because that will mess it up. It'll curl. So, we're just using these. Front part because they have that holographic foil and that will curl on your in your resin because it just I've tried it y'all and it ruined the project And these are, yeah, like I said, these are what I use. And these are, um, what's this stuff called? Uh, um, Oh, wow, that's going to look really cool, y'all. Yeah. A little bright, but it's going to look cool. Still. You know? Tomorrow, I'm going to go ahead and do another pour just to fill it up because I got like a little bit left. You know, hmm. I thought I had those leaves out. Huh? Oh, it's, it's, 
yeah because uh, I don't like that part sticking out and I tried it but it's not letting me sink it down anymore so it is what it is I thought I had those leaves sticking out Do not let any unholy I don't know what that means. These they're sayings, y'all. They're sayings. Where are my tweezers? You think you have it right here and you was just using it and they're right over here. Since this is going to be the back and it don't matter how, you know. And I put this little saying, it says, do not let anyone unwholesome talk come out of your mouth, but only what is helpful for building others up. Yeah, <laughs> that's pretty cute saying there. And, you know, let's give it a try. Oh, yeah, that's going to look awesome I want to pull it out I got a few bubbles you can see y'all oh well and my butterflies look so pretty they're covering up <laughs> let's cover it up and we'll let it it for the night and we'll do another one more layover tomorrow and then we'll let it sit all night and we'll see what happens okay good night okay I'm back it kind of hardened up a little bit to where I could put the rabbits in. And
I'm seeing something in here. That. Okay. Oh, good. There was something black in there. I don't know, in my mold. I had to get that out. I just heat that up so it won't. Not too bad. I kind of want them to look at each other. Y'all know what I'm saying? <laughs> And then I'll mix some more and pour in there. But I'm going to let that harden just a little bit. And as you see, I've been babysitting this. And it is what it is. I think I'm just going to let it rest like that and do a little mix later. But I do want to add some of these. Like on this one, I'm going to do the colorful ones.
It's already setting up. When I pour another set to fill this base up, they'll look like they'll be floating in there. Like little flower petals or something. And they make these things so small. Everything. Like they're floating. And people say, why don't you just mix it with the resin? Because this is like shard glass real heavy eventually they'll start floating down resin moves as it dries <coughs> so Hey guys, I'm back, and this is the reveal, the last day, and I've been waiting for this all day. Cut off work and said, yeah. Okay. Still popped up right in here. Yeah. And I did have an overflow right in here. I was trying to not to do that, but we can always cut that off, no problem. And maybe right here a little bit. But other than that. This light. Sorry y'all. Let's just go ahead and go for it. I don't know what it's going to look like on the other side. This is the drum roll. Da 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 da. Where is it? <laughs> MSR! MSR! I get cold chills. Wow. Wow. The, the, that's the overflow, y'all. Here. We'll go ahead and pull it all out. Look at the bunnies! <laughs> the um, cracks. I'm thinking the. Um, let me get some scissors. They came out little, you know. Look at the little uh, stones. But they came out cute, y'all. Isn't that gorgeous? Now what I'll do here is sand it. Sand it, sand it. To make it a higher gloss. This is what I was afraid of from the 
lamination. The lamination. And if you hear something, my dog. Sorry. <laughs> so that's what I was wondering if the laminating was going to do. It's okay. And I didn't know whether to use... I'm just cutting the excess off. Y'all do this, be careful. There. I'll sand that with my Dremel. I was wondering if the laminating was going to do that, y'all. Um, crinkle. Or, you know, by the... I'll put it like this so y'all can see it. The laminating part did that. Or when I put it on the remember I poured this first a thin coat and then I placed the picture it's not the laminating it is the other the thin coat <coughs> what happened that's what happened so now I know to go ahead and put the photo in first then pour your your resin that's what I'm thinking <clears throat> that's what that did there because I was looking at on uh, this one I put the photo in first and it didn't do it yet I have to finish filling this up because I just used my leftovers so and it hasn't done that on this one a few bubbles but that's about it So, I pour, I should have laid her picture in then. It still looks kind of cool, you know. I'll give her a different one, but hey, let me see if we can do it like this. See the picture? Because I, I poured the laminate first. I mean, the... I poured the laminate first. I poured the resin and then I placed the pitcher in and poured more resin, which caused this to float a little bit, and that's why it came out like this. Kinda looks kinda looks cool, don't it? And the rabbits, they're sitting so cute in there, you know. Just looking at each other. <laughs> if I could bring it. Let me put the camera back up. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm bumping y'all around. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, so next time, what I'll do is... <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. I'll just put the picture in, then the resin. I won't, you know, and then don't pour as much resin because you're going to need to have something to ta hold your, tack your lights down. You know what I'm saying? Because this back turned out gorgeous. Gorgeous, y'all. I need to trim some there. You know. But other than that, hey, hey. Now I know what to do next time. This is my first drawing at this, y'all. Her roses came out pretty on the side. You know? But other than that, it, it turned out cute, y'all. 
next time I know not to pour to put the pitcher in first then pour your thin a uh, small layer and let it chill for a little bit to where you can tack your lights down because if you don't your lights are going to float up you know what I'm saying and my bunny rabbits y'all look at them there's a baby we're so far apart <laughs> Yes, I love it. I'm going to keep this one. Yeah, I have a bunch of lights and a lot of uh, things. I wanted to show you all this. Don't forget to go and visit me on my Instagram. This is my Instagram. G so lovely underscore 64. I had a friend on Instagram made me this. And her name is Mel Sosi underscore 74 on Instagram. Uh, this is my handle. So anytime y'all want to go check me out, because sometimes I post a lot more than here and, you know, on Instagram. And I always do a little clip. But yeah, I'm know what to do next time on that. Okay, that's my sharing for today. And y'all have a great day. Bye.